Hey guys, my name is Ambika and all of you are here with me on Unacademy's YouTube channel which is Let's Crack CBSE Commerce. So guys, in this particular session we will going to talk about confusing words in detail but before that let's hold our hands together and let's dive deep into the world of Unacademy because I want to tell all of you that how an academy functions and why it is the greatest platform if you are genuinely an eager learner and eager um, if you are so excited to know something so this is the right platform for you and let me tell you that how an academy uh, functions and why it's a great deal that if you will be part of it you're going to have the gala time over here so we have got two subscriptions over here the first one is plus and the other one is uh, wait for it i'll let you know in a bit so let's talk about the plus subscription first herein you will going to have your daily live classes wherein you can chat with your educators you can engage in discussions you can ask n number of doubts you know when we are in the class we are being uh, we are being hi um, good evening sujal good evening again so we are being stopped by the teacher that hey we are rushing out of the time we can't help you right now and things like that but such things will surely not going to happen here next is all this is possible while the class is taking place next is we have got the live tests and quizzes wherein you can evaluate your preparation with our regular mock tests and quizzes and detailed and get detailed analysis on your performance so you can participate in the mock tests and quizzes they are exactly the replica of your question papers right and wherein you can analyze like how did you perform how many questions you have attempted how many were were correct and on what all topics you need extra efforts yeah so these all can be done here next is structured courses so all our courses are structured in line with your exam syllabus to help you best prepare for it so for example this much portion is coming for your half release and the whole lot is coming for your finals so we will going to divide our content in the similar fashion yeah so there's a structured pattern next is unlimited access so once you get the subscription you can check out the recorded courses at the comfort of your house you don't need to travel here and there you don't need to hop from one coaching center to the other dude you can use that time in learning yeah so what all you will get is daily life classes live tests and quizzes structured courses and unlimited access to all the other courses and they are simply beginning from 1041 rupees do that so cheap and wherein you are going to read all the subjects it's not specifically for your uh, business studies or maybe for your uh, english or for your physics chem bio anything yeah so everything will be specifically in 1041 rupees per month yeah so as i've already told you you will going to have live classes and this was all about a plus now let me tell all of you about a plus subscription so here in the plus subscription will going to give you a next level of you know uh, learning and teaching as well because here in it redefines the concept of teaching and learning both so here in the first mega factor of iconic is that you will going to have personal mentors yeah so you will going to have get one on one guidance from top experts as your personal mentor align learning strategy and resolve your concerns so these personal mentors will be right there for you at your doorstep here i meant with doorstep at your laptop screen mobile screen and they will going to resolve all your concerns all your problems yeah next we will going to have live doubt solutions so attend exclusive uh, doubt solving classes to solve your subject doubts get customized study plan to track your progress for example uh, if you need particular help in particular topic so we will going to customize and with this personal mentor you can customize your progress your way of learning yeah so they will going to help you out that you need to spend this many uh, these many um, hours in particular chapter particular topic so that can be done with your personal mentor next is we have got the parent connect so regular open hours for parents discuss their learners their child's their what's performance report with mentor 
receive weekly performance reports and whatsoever were the benefits of plus they are right here hi somya good evening and our educators they are so amazing they are so prolific they are as i call them you know the demi gods or perhaps the uh, superheroes this time they are not wearing capes but they are wearing the un academy t-shirts and they are right here to help you out right next we have got batches wherein we will going to dedicate our time to our ncert books as well because as we grow up we start giving less of the importance to our ncert books but as you all know that cbse focuses more on ncert so that is why we have got specific batches for ncert as well and there is a comprehensive syllabus right so three courses to this topic four lectures to this topic and things like that so that was all about an academy so the question arises uh, how you can access this amazing uh, feature of an academy it's very easy all you need to do is go to your play store type an academy learning app this is how it will going to look like and you simply need to click on install yeah so it will be right there on your laptops or mobile phones next thing is how you will going to come to know like which educator is conducting which session at what time and for that we have got our own telegram link which is quest 12 cbse commerce yeah use this link and it will be right here for all of you all the information the plus features were india's best educators interactive live classes live tests and quizzes and creative corner is also there creative corner is a platform is basically a place wherein you will going to learn origami magic tricks vedic math and uh, you know uh, and 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 poetry writing and n number of other things and these all will be uh, taught to you by the creative expert because you know that cbc doesn't want any one of us to become simply the robots who knows only the bookish content they want the overall development of the child so that is why we have come up with creative corner and iconic is already having all the features of plus along with that personal mentors live doubt solution parent connect and study planner and the pricing is so cheap this is for plus wherein you are getting 11th and 12th subscription and along with that creative corner subscription as well so i would request that go for 24 months or for 18 months wherein if you are in grade 11 so that will be carried further for your grade 12 as well yeah and for that you can use my code which is ambika and this is the great feature okay so you can use my code which is ambika and you will going to get 10% of discount on your enrollment that is 10 yeah it's big it's huge enough isn't it so use my code ambika and you will surely going to get the 10% of discount this is for iconic the pricing is right here that is for 18 months or for 24 months again you can use my code which was ambika and in the same uh, way you will going to get the 10% of discount here with iconic as well right so um, that was something really amazing about an academy yes and i hope you guys are super 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 convinced that all of you needs to use this app and all of you please 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 try an academy this is the best 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 learning please yeah so with this let's begin with the confusing words so there are certain words you know for example four or four um let's just say affect or effect we get so confused that where exactly what term is being required so hi sumit good evening yeah so i will going to help you out like what all terms are being required at at what all places and with few examples we'll going to discuss them out so i hope you all are excited so let's check out those confusing terms those confusing words the first one is accept and accept i repeat it is accept and accept there are difference there's a difference okay accept and accept 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 okay this accept means when you're receiving something from somebody that is accepting something peach say, said he decided to accept that offer in texas 
so pete has decided that he will going to accept he will going to receive that offer which texas has given to him a store that does not accept checks so there is a store which does not accept yeah which does not take or accept the checks it simply perhaps deal with cash next is accept accept which is leave out so they won't even uh, be together except weekend so there are there is a high probability that they will not be there simply leave out the weekends rather there are less of the chances where they will be together so except the weekends on weekdays they aren't together everything was in good order except the boots so a person like me and if my mom tells me to arrange the cupboard so i am going to arrange simply the cupboards but maybe the boots are staying like there so i have left out except the boot everything is arranged so that is except and except clear the next one is affect and effect affect means you are influenced by something or something has influenced you so that is affecting and effect ka matlab kya hota hai kisi bhi cheez ka result kya aaya that is our effect clear poverty can affect anyone regardless of age race gender or social background so that is affect it can influence it can affect you badly yeah so poverty can effect can show effect of it clutches on anyone regardless of somebody's age race gender or social background she wasn't going to let a little rain affect her good mood today so maybe because of the rain um there is a rain and she is making sure that rain will not going to spoil her mood so that rain will not going to affect her good mood for the day the effect means result her statement had a surprising effect on dean so she perhaps has given one of the statements and that has a surprising effect on dean did his leaving have any effect on you so that is effect somebody has left you so are you being affected by it is it like uh, affecting you in a bad manner so that is affecting next is allowed and allowed yeah that is allowed and allowed yeah so allowed means permitted she opened the front door which was still unlocked and allowed brutus to go in first so allowing means to permit somebody you are letting uh, somebody to do something permitting permission yeah you are allowed to sit here wasn't he allowed to be a human yeah so that is permitting allowing somebody to be something or somebody or whatsoever you want allowed means loud clearly heard he read the numbers aloud again it is he read the numbers aloud again clear so that is our term allowed she laughed aloud at his reaction a little too loudly quickly covering her mouth as other diners glanced her way so that is allowed thoda zor se baat karna that is i and and you can clearly hear that right so that is allowed the next is allude and elude allude elude allude means make direct reference when you are hi rimi so when you are uh, alluding something allusion aap log ek reference create kar rahe hain that is allude and elude means escape from somewhere yeah or we, which we can say elope also right we can only allude to some of these points so we can make references to few of these points when you are referencing when you are making a reference you can term the use allude you can use the term allude the teacher asks the students to not allude to any online sources in their research papers so the teacher had made it very clear that you are not going to make any reference points in your research paper from online sources clear so allude means making direct reference from something eluding means escape from somewhere or something 
the criminal was able to elude the police in the crowded mall yeah so the the uh, this criminal of ours has eloped so he has escaped uh, from the clutches of the police the criminal was able to elude the police in the crowded mall whatever her disease it has eluded the doctors for months right it had eluded the doctors for months next is eight eight is simply a past tense of eat and that is eight 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 yeah you have to put out emphasis on the word and that's how you can say it very clearly so eight is like past tense of eat as i've already told you i ate a while ago on my break so that is i ate she ate the meat and drank some of the cool water so she already had lunch or dinner she she's already done with her meal so she ate this is ate newly crowned heroine lydia larkin won the election by eight votes right so that is the digit eight the figure the number eight when eight years of age he was the best scholar at the famous school at harrow yeah so when he was simply eight he was a great scholar that is the digit eight 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 next is break and break yeah so break is splitting uh, you know smashing something breaking somebody's arm uh, maybe face and things like that perhaps breaking a <coughs> a mug so that is breaking smashing splitting into two give yourself a break and get some rest so you are maybe uh following a monotony there is a monotonous routine so you want to get a break so you are splitting you are smashing that monotony with this break he is going to break his leg tomorrow yeah so he is planning to break his leg tomorrow somebody else's leg that is break and this is break wherein which is like a stopping device yeah it is sometimes necessary to use water to keep the brake wheel cool so there in a car we have brake wheels um and how we have clutch accelerator and brake there so for that you have to you should use it is necessary to use water there so they are specifically talking about a stopping device that is brake out of the corner of his eye he saw the brake lights of the woman's car as she drove down the driveway so that is break stopping device and that one was break which which is smashing or splitting the next one is buy and buy yeah they are maybe sounding pretty similar to us but when we are writing it down kindly check on their spellings buy is a simple preposition yeah and buy means purchase when you are buying something clear i thought maybe by now you would have adjusted so it is buy it is simply a preposition which is being used here then he added maybe i can buy old costume so maybe i can buy i can purchase new or old costumes by that time the others had already retired so by that time the others had already retired and this by b u y means buy posters of flyers or something so whatever you are fine with whatever you are comfortable with either the posters or the flyers buy them purchase them next is capital and capital it is very clear it is the first one is capital and the next one is capital clear capital means city like for example uh, jaipur is the capital of rajasthan yeah and capital also signifies to wealth money clear and that capital means building clear we have left the capital city for the other side of the planet so we have decided that we want to visit the other side of the planet so we have uh, left this particular capital for a time being capital is in the capital grounds are monuments to the memory of ulysses 
so in the building on in the ground floor maybe there is a monument yeah i mean there is a monument which is which we can call this a capitol and there is um, perhaps in the memory of ulysses who was a great sailor there is a statue of it yeah or a monument maybe yeah capital again is instead you have to find small things over which to argue like whether the capital gains tax should be raised so here in it has something related to the money capital wealth if you are from accounts background you know this term pretty well the capital uh, which is required to um, establish this business is maybe 2.3 crore so the capital here represents money the state capital square to acres is not owned by the city so this building square is not owned by the state it is not owned by the government next one is chorus which is rough okay which is not at all soft but rather it is rough and coarse is his way of path silk fabrics chorus wool woolen cloth paper and cloak and cloaks are manufactured so there is this company which manufactures silk fabrics chorus woolen cloth not the soft one but rather the rough one and course is are there any golf courses around here so that is way or path wherein you are asking for a particular stream course next example is the eyes and skin are dark the beard often well developed the nose broad and flat the lips coarse and jaws heavy so maybe we are defining somebody some person and that person has got a coarse a rough lips fewer students are opting for science courses nowadays so uh, the percentage of the people who were opting science has fallen down it has decreased so science course that is stream clear next is ensure and ensure it is ensure n and it is ensure so ensure means when you are guaranteeing something that is ensuring yeah and ensure is financial liability i must protect them and ensure their honor and mind remain uh, i must protect them and ensure their honor and mind remain intact so that is guaranteeing somebody about something ensure is tom couldn't get his card insured because he had six accidents in 3 years all of which had been his fault so that is insured wherein you are talking about the finance and the liability maybe attached to it or maybe something which is related to finance she made him what he was but his suffering was necessary to ensure his survival to guarantee his survival whatever he was going through that was required clear ensure is he ensured his new house against fire insurance we all know this term right so these days people are getting a lot of uh, medical insurances also post covid right so that is insured next is farther which is talking about distance there is a physical distance uh, between things that is farther and further means to take it further take it ahead which is to a greater degree or extent going or uh, extending beyond example for farther is the nearest house was much farther than she thought so she must be thinking that hey i can walk till there but the nearest house was much farther then she thought rome is farther from london than paris is so it is talking about the physical distance further is he offered no further information and she left uncomfortable about and she felt uncomfortable about asking so further is like no further information no uh, you know extended information is being provided by him king declined to comment further as the investigation is ongoing so the king declined to comment anything on this investigation so in fact let's just say the politicians were mum and they decided not to speak further on um, sushant singh rajput's case so that is further yeah taking it ahead further 
Next is for and for. So that is for for preposition and for is the digit, the number. For. Yeah. So I have waited at that station for five hours. That is for five hours. For he is four years older than I am. Yeah. He was going to like the clothes she bought for the trip. For the trip, which is again a preposition. For the digit four is, they might call a halt. Halt is stopping at some place. Here or we will have to do another four miles without eating. So that is referring to digit four. Next is peace, which means uh, quietness, shanti. That's peace, which is uh, against, hi Akshar. So which is against war. That is our peace. And peace is tukra, part or portion of something, right? Uh, Akshat, we are discussing the confusing words. So, how do we get confused when we hear such terms? So, I am discussing about that in detail. Peace is, leave me in peace, he looks, his look seemed to say. So, he wanted to say, obviously, he did not say, but his expressions, his looks were pretty clear that he wants to live in peace. Or yaha pe konsa wala piece use karoge, not tukde wala piece, no. It is something relevant to absence of war. Now cut me a piece of that pie. So you want a piece of that pie. So obviously you do not want quietness there, but you want a piece, part or portion of that pie. We will end war by making, uh, your voice is so melodious. Okay, that's how you can say it, Akshar. Thank you, by the way. We will end war by making peace more desirable. Yeah, so that is one of the ways to end the war. Clear? He turned his attention to the fire and tucked another piece of bark into the bright coal. So that is like, again, peace, peace. Next is loose and loose. Yeah, so this loose means you are free. Like loosen up hair. Yeah, and this loss means or loose means when you are losing something. Yes. So L O O S E means free from something, and L O O sorry L O S E means to be unable to find something, to fail to hold on to something, yeah, fit to be defeated. Clear? Example for L O O S E is fortunately the curls were now loose waves. Right, so somebody has got the curls and now they are loose waves. So they are all open up, they are free. Clear? I lost some battle every year. I lost some cattle every year. What's with me? So that's cattle. Everyone knows now, thanks to Ken's loose tongue. So maybe you were uh, trying to hide out something, but then because of Ken's loose tongue, that's, that's free tongue, he revealed out the secret. That is, F R E E. She began to lose uh, her influence in the company. So, like she was, uh, you know, trying, she has failed to have a hold in her own company. Next is fourth and fourth. Yeah, like fourth. That is this and that is fourth. Okay, forward and this means come after third. So, fourth means. The snow is gone and the flowers are ready to spring forth. They are ready to come ahead. They are ready to come, uh, they are ready to come out. That is forth. Another example is, he paced back and forth across the room deep in thought. So maybe he was thinking about something and he was pacing, he was walking back and forth across the room in deep thoughts. The next one is forth. So this is the fourth event in the past few days. Yeah. Uh, it's the fourth day for the fashion show. That's fourth. Clear? That is F-O-U-R-T-H. F-O-U-R-T-H, fourth room on your left. So my friend is residing in the fourth room from the left. Next is plain and plain. So plain means something which is not so fancy, something which is simple. Hi, Sakshi. So that is plain. Clear? And P L A N E means flat surface. So that is. Hi, Harman. 
her room was plain and basic so it was uh, pretty plain pretty decent nothing fancy about it the surfaces which are not flat are called curved surface this is something which we all know the flat is plain p l a n e i am glad we are out in plain side right that is a very simple side nothing of uh, nothing uh, like artificial there pretty original authentic and simple the surface of book match box a mirror table etc are example of plain surfaces clear next is principle and principle so this is the major error which we do make every now and then that is principle and principle clear so this P L E जिसके लास्ट में E आ रहा है बच्चा अगेन लाइक रूल इट इज E रिमेंबर इट दैट वे इज इट इज प्रिंसिपल रूल ठीक है एंड दिस प्रिंसिपल इज द चीफ पर्सन द प्रिंसिपल विच वी हैव इन आर स्कूल दैट इज प्रिंसिपल ही वॉज अ मैन ऑफ प्रिंसिपल एंड गुड टू हिज वर्ड दैट इज इज अ मैन ऑफ वर्ड ऑफ हिज ओन वर्ड्स ही वैल्यू which poem uh, which poem harman are we talking about here the next is principle the principal of the school is retiring this year so that is this principle two principles of happiness are being kind and smiling a lot so that is the two rules of happiness are that you are supposed to be kind and you have to keep on smiling every now and then and this is the principle yeah the three person Mary was the principal in the television series for 10 long years that that is principal next is quiet and quiet quiet means silent yeah and quiet is really or positively sit quietly so humne yahan pe quietly mein e center mein aata hai before t before the sound t and quiet is here this is this no 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 that is not being done childhood nahi kiya hai abhi that we will going to begin soon bachcha hi nidhi good evening childhood we'll going to begin soon and the other one is quiet which is uh, where in e is coming at the end which means really or positively so the first one where in we are uh, referring to quiet which is silent carmen Ret uh, remain quiet for a few minutes allowing him to think about it right next example is i would think less of you if you didn't try he said in a quiet voice quiet means in a hushed voice yeah in a silent voice like not speaking way too much but maybe in a hushed tone this quiet example is you are growing into quiet Give an idea, Harman. Soon, I will let you know. I will going to share. Uh, you know when the class will be there on Telegram. No, so follow me there. You'll get. You'll come to know. Yes, Harman. You are growing into quiet, the young lady. So that is into really positively beautiful lady. There was a barber shop, and I could see a calendar on the wall, but I couldn't quiet read it. so unfortunately i ab yahan pe hum log silent wala to quiet nahi use kar sakte hai na so that is this quiet this uh it is uh, quest 12 cbse science that is the name of the channel wherein the information will be shared with you bachcha so you can check it out there yes harman wait let me type it here for you that is that's the link uh, that's the telegram uh, channel so you can check it out there itself yeah next is then and then yeah so this then is used for comparison and then means after that i will do this so that is then at that time yeah so he thinks you are better than us so wherein we are making comparison so this is t h a n wala comparison mein hame t h a n wala chahiye no problem bachcha no problem what happened sakshi uh, why you ma'am please repeat again 
previous word that was quiet and quiet okay bachcha keep it uh, i mean remember it this way dekho silence me last me e a raha hai silence so let's just give quiet ka e pehle you have to frame a story around it tabhi na ye wale words yaad rahenge right so silence me and agar last me e a raha hai so here in hum quiet ko e pehle de denge so this is quiet wherein we are simply using e here और क्वाइट में मतलब दिस इज क्वाइट पॉसिबल दैट आई माइट बी ऑन लीव टूमोरो सो इस वाले में ई बाद में आएगा जस्ट कीप यू हैव टू फ्रेम स्टोरी अराउंड इट एंड दैट्स हाउ यू कैन रिमेंबर देम सो हम लोग देन और देन डिस्कस कर रहे थे जहां पे कंपैरिजन की बात है वहां पे आप लोग टी एच ए एन यूज करेंगे या ही थिंक्स यू आर बेटर देन अस एलेक्स हैड बीन हाइडिंग मोर देन मोर देन अ father clear t h e n is then he picked up another box it's quite easy right so isme e last me aa raha hai bachcha very good nidhi so that is really or positively very good then she ran straight into the fence like she didn't see it so that is t h e n later at that time that is t h e n next is two and ठीक है ओनली डिफरेंस इज परफेक्ट थंडरबर्ड लाइटनिंग फैब वर्क फैब वर्क ग्रेट 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 दैट सी करेक्ट वे परफेक्ट नेक्स्ट इज टू विच इज टॉकिंग अबाउट द डिरेक्शन यू हैव बिन टू ऑस्ट्रेलिया हैव इन टू सो दैट इज स्पेसिफिकली रेफरिंग टू दिस टू रेफरेंस इन द कॉन्टेक्स ऑफ द डिरेक्शन एंड दिस टू मीन्स Hey, I too invited for the party. So therein we are using to T O O, which means also. Yeah, she had to move a few things to make room, but that wasn't too hard, right? That is T O O. Along with that, so that is T O O. My daughter is coming for me to take me there, to to take me in some particular direction, maybe. Yeah. Hi, T M Notes. The next one is it's not too late to change your mind. So that is two. Two is talking about the excessive, maybe also along with that. That is T O O. This is the major one, though the easiest, but the major one. Yeah. So that is weak and weak. Yeah. This is so easy, but we still tend to make mistakes here. So this week, जहाँ पे W E A K है, that means is it too windy? But is it too windy? T O O, thunderbird. That's the wrong. Is it too? Oh, sorry, it is too windy. T W O, excessive. ज़्यादा है ना हवा. So is is it? It is too windy. T W O will be there. Yeah. Can he do this work too? Perfect, 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 Sakshi. Right. Ha ha ha. I know, right, Nidhi. So here in we have got weak, which means feeble, which has no energy to do something. That's weak. And the weak is seven days well a week. Yeah. She was too weak to move. She had no energy to move. That is feeble. Clear. they made her weak and frightened so the kidnappers must have kidnapped somebody and because of which she is weak now this week is i can meet you sometime next week apna hafta wala week he offered to buy the food if i cooked the next week and i agreed so that is week again 7 days wala boss this is the major one Which is weather and weather, whether this or that. So that is ye wala weather, W H E T H E R wala weather, right? Which is W H E T H E R, right? Or ye wala weather is atmospheric conditions, जो हम मौसम की बात कर रहे हैं. So that is this wala weather. Easy way is बच्चा एक वाले word को याद रखो, उसकी spelling याद रखिए. और जो नहीं है That is the one जिसमे आपको सेकेंड सिनारियो में उसे यूज करना है राइट 
Sakshi did not get your question. It will be T O. He can do this work too. Ha, bachcha. That is T double O. T double O will be there. Right, Sakshi? Okay. So W E A T H E R is talking about. No, I have not picked those one because I have same sound words pe work kar rahi hu Nidhi. So there is a confusion when it comes when they have a same similar uh, sound. Yeah, so we are doing that one, not neither nor in uh, either or. No, we are not doing that. So W E A T H E R is about atmospheric conditions. So the weather was balmy, adding to the enjoyment of the day. So this is about weather. Acha mausam. The weather is supposed to be nice this weekend. So, as per the uh, reports of weather, uh, weather reporter, so the weather will be perfect for this weekend. So, therein, this is this wala weather, W E A wala weather. Or ye wala weather is if in case whether we want to admit it or not, we all wish everyone would like us. Yeah. So. But your climate is W E A T H E R, right, Sakshi? So this is weather. So हम लोग ये चाहे या ना चाहे, मतलब हम लोग ये admit करे या नहीं, but we would like that, uh, you know, we would like to have um, everybody around us. और हम लोग चाहते हैं कि सब लोग हमें पसंद करे. So हम ये, you know, weather. This is W H E T H E R. Whether in this case we accept this or not, whether or not you take my deal, I will help her. So you accept it or you don't accept it, whether or not. So that is this weather. Remember any one of uh, the weather's spelling and जो दूसरा वाला है, उसको फिर दूसरे सिनारियों में use करना है. Next is which or which. Yeah. So this which is which one? You want to buy which color of tie? So that is definitely which. W H I C H. Or दूसरी is which. I know they are sounding similar, but there's a difference in spelling. And this which is sorceress, yeah. So which book do you want? Which of those houses do you live in? So that is which, which one? And which is the sorceress? Maybe some magical creature, yeah. So wow, I have never met a witch before. Which ko ham log Hindi mein shayad churel bolte hain if I'm not wrong. That's witch, okay. One wicked witch named Moby stole him and carried him away, keeping him as a prisoner. So that is witch, sorceress, जो magic जानती हो, जिसके पास magical powers हो. So that is W I T C H वाला witch. <laughs> I know Sakshi. And this one is who and whom. So हम लोग ना बच्चा who हमेशा subject के कौन like Mrs. Hey, don't call her a witch. She was a gem, yeah. She helped Mrs. Pearson, so we can't call her a witch. The next one is who and whom. अगर हम किसी subject के reference में context में बात कर रहे हैं, so we are supposed to use here who. Otherwise, अगर वहाँ पे object पे बात हो रही है, so that will be whom. Who would you like to go on vacation with? Yeah, so who would like to go? Sorry, who would like to go on vacation? So that is we are talking about yeah, positive witch. Uh, we don't have such person, dude. We don't have positive witch. So that is who? To whom was the letter addressed? To whom? So yaha pe letter jo hai that is basically of our subject and whom is the person. तो उस पर्सन को हमने यहाँ पे ऑब्जेक्ट के तौर पे रेफर किया है, सो डेट इस व्हाई इट इस होम, क्लियर? Who ate my sandwich? And I do not know with whom I will go to the prom. I have no clue with whom, right? So that is हरमन ठीक है मैं वो ग्रुप बना लूँगी ना, I will surely go into let you know about that, yeah? So these were the few confusing words which we tend to, uh, you know, we wherein we tend to make certain blunders with their spellings every now and then. Yeah. Telegram uh, group banayenge nidhi. That's the plan for sure. Jaise hi banayenge, I will surely going to inform you all because I want all of you there and I want you to be pretty regular with all the sessions and classes, whichever we are 
having there on an academy on a platform here on youtube so for that we need to have that group so okay so uh, that's the plan and i hope if anybody is new here i would genuinely request that guys please download the an academy app if you are literally satisfied if you are literally contented then don't forget to use my code when you are getting a subscription or in fact jab aap special classes bhi loge so that time you can use my code which is ambika i know i know i know sakshi for sure we're going to make it so for that also you can use my code which is ambika jab aap plus k classes bhi check kar rahe ho so please guys use my code and as you already know you will going to get 10% of discount so tomorrow i will going to come up with some another amazing uh, thing when it comes to english so that's the plan for tomorrow plus we course bachcha uh, next week se start kar dete hain sakshi that's the plan let's just see how it goes <laughs> so next next week done next week done yeah all right then guys uh, please download the app and don't forget to use my code ambika and with that i would like to take your leave do take care of yourself don't make blunders with these words i hope you are very sorted thank you nidhi nidhi saying that join mams uh, use mams code and you will going to get super discount so please to uh, please 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 use that yeah and uh, don't try to don't uh, make uh, errors with those particular words i think you're super sorted with those words now yeah so with that uh, i'm going to take your leave i'll come up tomorrow with some other fun things about english yeah and they will surely going to help you out whenever you are speaking whenever you are writing to any of the contents right with that i'll take your leave again and bye bye